everybody. Man, it's it's like you it's like it seemed like the norm is for people to be mean, ignorant, like crazy. Like we really got to change that, man, cuz it's like every time I come to check in to shippers or receivers, right? Sometimes you have a security guard or whoever checks you in. So anybody that I come in touch with, I'm, I pride myself in being polite and just being nice. <laughs> it is, like, I don't have to force it. But what I'm saying is because I get multiple people, security guards or whoever checks you in, they always, like the guy here, he was like, wow, you so nice. Like, I really wish more drivers was nice like you. I said, what you mean? I don't know. Every time drivers come in, they always cuss me out. Or, I mean, it's like maybe his wife did him wrong or something. I just got to sit here and take it. <laughs> I said, damn. So, I'm just saying. I learned it. Like, I used to be a correctional officer. So, they told us, do not bring home to work and do not take work to home that can apply for anything that could be the matter of life and death even though this is not life and death but if you got problems at home or you got problems like don't don't take your problems out on the next person they didn't do it to you like if i was going through something like you wouldn't know I was going through it unless I vented it to you and even if I vented it to you it wouldn't make you feel some kind of way because I'm just talking about what I'm going through but I have seen it because like I said sometimes other drivers mistreat other drivers and most likely it's probably because they got some shit going on at home with wifey or husband or kids or people or their business going I don't know but learn to not bring your problems out here on the road especially when you're driving because there's nothing worse than you driving down this road and you mad sad and depressed and that emotion can make you have an accident it can make you not pay attention that's like distracted driving because you're not learning how to leave work at work and home at home like let's learn our manners man i'm glad my mother raised me with manners thank you mom may god rest your soul but thank you mom for raising me to have manners like i said i know i cut it up but that's part of being humorous and enjoying life but when i'm out here and about i know how to be professional and be kind kind let's make kind an epidemic not hate jeez